How's it going, bros? My name's Pewdiepie. Welcome back to some more Corpse Party. The creepiest motherfucking game you ever played. Or watched me play. Let's play. Uh -huh. uh -huh. oh, do we actually get to play now? Ah. Oh, ow, oh, my leg. I can move it, so I guess it's just a sprain. Oh. Oh, where? I'm not at home, am I? No, you're not. No, it can't be. Oh, God. Oh, God, we play as a girl. What? It's so dark. I can barely see a thing. Is this, this is school? Oh, it is. What's going on? What the hell is this place? It's your school. All right, so we can walk around. Finally. Um, all right, that's pretty awesome. Uh-oh. <gasps> is that Seiko? Seiko! 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 We can't reach her, right? This isn't good. Oh, good. It looks like her eyebrows are, like, freaking out or some shit. Well, I guess we have no choice but go in here. Hopefully, we won't die. That hasn't been a save yet, so that'd be great if we will. Oh god, I'm dead. I'm dead. Ah, that really hurt. My ankle is in pretty bad shape. Great, that means if we get chased, we're practically dead. Heavenly Post, third student reported missing. One by one, the young students of Heavenly Host XXXXX school seem to be disappearing, as now a third student has joined the ranks of the missing. Classmates testify that fifth grader <laughs> was on her way home from school, but gets separated from her friends in the hall and hasn't been seen since. Police are investigating the possibility of a serial kidnapping and have assigned countless investigators to the case in hopes of a speedy solution. However, 10 days have already passed since the first disappearance, giving parents and classmates ample cause for concern. Some, I feel like that's related to what's going on here. I feel like the time will be distorted and stuff in this game. Yes, all right, I'll Seiko! save you. Seiko! 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 <sighs> Thank goodness, she's still breathing. Seiko! Come on, Seiko, wake up! Oh god, she, she's a zombie. Oh god, man, <laughs> Alright. Naomi, what's up? Don't you what's up me? I thought you were dead. Oh? Me? Where? Where are we? What's going on? That's what I like to know. Oh, good. We're so dead, bros. I never. F oh, God. Seiko? Oh, God. Uh, it ain't budging. These windows are still up tight. And it's pitch black out there. I can't make heads or tails what I'm seeing. What the hell is going on? Don't s fucking swear. Well, this is clearly a school building. Don't the desk seem unusually small to you, though? What? Is, what why? What does that mean? Oh, God. Like elementary school. So we fell down a floor. Maybe that's it. An elementary school? Masaka. Masaka. <laughs> oh, she's reading. What's she reading? Mind cut. What does it say? Oh, God. What is going on? What is it? The, the, the printout out in the wall. It says Heavenly Host Elementary Notice All Faculty and Students. Heavenly host? Is, is it that? Oh. Oh. oh my god, what is happening? Where the hell are we? And where are our friends? And Mrs. Jew? Calm down, Seiko. Don't get so worked up. I'm getting worked up here, okay? Come here. I'm such a fucking weeaboo. Seiko and I just stood there in silence. 
hand in hand. Oh my god, I shipped him so much. It was the first time in my life that I'd been shaking so hard I could hear my teeth chatter. I'd become completely lightheaded and couldn't even think straight. Much less wrap my brain around what was happening to us. Getting goosebumps. I kept telling myself it's all a dream. Some horrible nightmare. But no matter how hard I wished for it, I just couldn't wake up. And the silence was the worst part of it all. I couldn't take it anymore. I had to say something. Anything. What is gonna happen? Hey, I don't have the slightest idea what's going on. But how about we try finding a way out of here? A way out? We can't just stand here quaking in terror. We need to do something, you know? Besides, I don't want to be in this creepy place any longer than I have to. But their windows are all sealed shut. And I don't just mean they're stuck or locked. It's like they're decorations on the wall and I don't even think they can open. Oh good. Is it even possible to leave this building? I'm not sure, but there might be an entrance way or an emergency exit or something. Some means of getting outside. I don't think so. You're right. And it's a lot better than just standing around. I feel like I'm going to go all loony in here if we keep this up. Yes. Yosh. Then, first step is to leave this room. We got to keep our spirits up. After all, it's probably not just the two of us in here. The others have to be around here somewhere, right? Yeah. And if we can reunite with them, we'll find a way out of here together. That's the spirit! So much spirit right now. I had no reason to believe any of that, what I just said. I was probably delirious, to be honest. But I knew that if I didn't act, I'd start to be go mad. I'd start to scream. I'd be inconsolable. So in desperation, I put on the strongest front I could manage. You go, girl. What is this? So that was the character introductions. Direct the eye towards any character and press the X button to learn more about him and her. When you're done, exit through the door on the southeast side of the room to resume play. Okay, that's a weird way to find out about the characters. I thought we just did that for the last fucking 40 minutes, but Jesus, okay. I guess I want to know more about Satoshi. 17-year-old student in Kensaragi Academy Senior. Fairly average but popular, known for being both kind and cowardly in equal measure. Ha! Despite his timidness, he's very personable and open, which, op which complements his general sensitivity towards others and make him a natural leader. Let's find out about these two, Naomi and... A 16-year-old student frequently greets Satoshi with, oh, not you again. What? Having lost her father a few years back, Naomi and her mother now depends on another moral support. Still, she remains optimistic and cheerful. Her, her home life has given her interest in nursing, which she intends on pursuing. She spends her time studying, aiming for acceptance to medical school. Okay. You know what? That's it for now. That's exit. Come on, Naomi, let's go. Okay. Right. The spirit music is gonna turn quickly. Wait a second. Oh god, what happened? Ah! Another earthquake? No! Is, is it over? I had enough. Let's just get out of this room. But what's wrong? This hallway looks totally different than it did before. So the earthquake changes it? Yeah, uh, maybe. Probably not. <laughs> Alright, I guess that means we can finally keep moving. Gap is really too narrow. It seems crossable, but it's a little too wide to risk jumping. Probably means we're gonna have to find something to put in between. There's a yellow fluid congealing inside the rusted bucket. What the hell like- Oh, god damn it. P? It might be. Ew, don't say that. I know this game gets really fucking, like, intense. But it's also, like, weird because it's so cute and, like, maybe we can use these planks somewhere here. 
Hey, Naomi. Something wrong with your leg. Oh, yeah. I was so freaked out, I forgot all about it. I think I sprained my ankle when I fell. Well, that's not good. Will you be okay? I can walk at least. I'm sure I'll heal on its own. Yeah, but you shouldn't push yourself. Here, lean on my shoulder, okay? That's adorable. Here's a loose board lying on the ground. Take it with you. Yes! Fuck yeah! Acquired loose board! You come with me, bitch. That's right, girl. That's right, girl. The loose board coming with me, girl. Gotta boot that loose board on the turd. Gotta get the pee in my... I don't fucking know. God damn it. God damn it. Yeah, just put... Hey, Naomi! What about that loose board? Why else would you pick up a loose board unless you knew it? Come on! I don't know, it seems kind of beat up, but I guess it's pretty solid. Try it. The loose board has been set in place. One of us is gonna die here, I feel it. No, we're alive, both alive, fantastic. That looks fucking creepy, so let's not go in there. Let's go in here. Oh shit, what is going on here? Please wait. What? Huh? You say something, Seiko? Mm, yeah. It wasn't you. It was obviously a boy. Come on. I definitely felt the presence of some kind. Okay, we can't go up there. Looks like the creepy room it is. Hooray! I know a lot of people might uh, say this looks pretty weird or bad, but I think it looks really good. I don't know, for a RPG maker. <laughs> <laughs> Horror game, I guess. I know it's not anymore, but... Ah! What's wrong, Naomi? Oh, God. Look over there. Aren't those bones? Like people bones? Oh, God. Why? Why? Why is there a dead person here? Wait, let me look at them more closely. Why? Maybe they're not real. They're real, okay? They're real. They're realer than... Okay, not a lot of things, actually, but... They really are somebody's bones. Ah! Pull your shit together! You two. What? <gasps> you two are new victims, are you not? A g g g ghost? Who are you? I was brought here against my will and confined just like you. Confined? So I get to ask. We know where he is, so let's ask about confined. Confined? Do you mean there's no way out? I'm afraid not. This school exists in a reality all, all its own. Cut off from the world, you know? So, why have we been brought here? They brought you. They're constantly bringing new victims into this school. More and more. All the time. Sinless innocence, one after another. This is a cursed multi-dimensional nexus. Oh yeah, I know of those. Multiple planes of existence, all piled on top of one another, created by powerful, vengeful spirits. God damn it. Close space. Or perhaps close space. It's you, and we are well, are the unlucky victims of an inescapable abduction. Closed spaces, indeed. And it seems you two are not the only ones to have been brought here. I'm sensing numerous others. <gasps> it's you, bros. Uh, does that does that mean everybody else is here too? Probably, yes. Are they... Senpai. Senpai. Are they okay, I wonder? Senpai. So our friends are in the school too? I don't know the exact number. But I do know that others were pulled into these spaces at the same time as you. They are definitely in this school. <laughs> oh my god, that's such good news. Now we're the weary. They're here. We're not alone. <laughs> That means Mashida's here too. I'll bet that makes you feel a lot better, right? I don't know about that. However, you cannot meet them. What? They are definitely in this school. 
but the space they occupy differs from the space we occupy. If you wish to see your friends, you must find some means of entering the space, their space, or bringing them into this space. Oh, that's nice. Even then, escape is nigh impossible. But at least you'll be able to die together. That's that's very nice. Thank you kindly, blue ball of lightning of death. Oh, oh, good. Is there no way out of here then? You said we were brought here by vengeful spirits, right? Who are they? And why have they taken us? I don't know. Neither the motives or of our captors, nor a means of escaping this hell. All I know is that with some effort, you can at least live out your days together in the same space. And that alone is a fate worth fighting for. It sounds like, God damn it! Two heads are better than one. Your chances and your opportunities are so much greater than working together. When working together. Do whatever you can to find a way out of here. Don't end up like us. Oh god, what was that? The door unlocked. Oh, what? No. Ah! Uh-oh. Now we run. We have to get out of here now. Oh god. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. 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 Oh god. I'm sorry. Oh god. I'm going. All right. I'm going. Oh fuck that place. Fuck that place. Hard oh, man. Pant pants. Go. Go. Oh. Are, are you all right, Seiko? Yeah, but what the hell was that? A child spirit? It did kind of glow. I never believed in ghosts before. Is this really happening? There were definitely ghosts in there. First time I've seen something like that. So you saw it too, right? Mm. And we were talking to it. I just... I don't understand any of that. Except that there's no easy way out for us. Like it or not, we're stuck in here. It'll be okay. Let's just, you know, march on with our heads held high. Or something. I love the music. So we go down there. No, we can't. No, we can't, can Can we go down there, go? Can we go, go, go down there, go? Can we take the pee? Can we take the take the pee? Can we go down, now, 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 there, go? Why did we go in there? There's nothing there, obviously. Let's try it again. Fuck it, y'all up, right? Hopefully she's not there anymore. Oh god, she isn't. Oh, thank heavens. What is that? What the heck is this? Was this here before? I don't know, but it's just a picture, right? No, it's not. It's a bunnies or something. I bet this is a save station. Huh? Was there always a candle here? I don't think so, but doesn't it look awfully familiar? Save station! Gotta love my save stations! Fantastic! We did it. Okay, cool. So it's very, very, very similar to all the awesomeness. No running in the halls. Any student caught running will be severely disciplined. YOLO! You can tell me what to do. Law Breaker 2014. Can we go in here? Locked. What does this say? Admit it, you hate all your friends. Eventually, you'll kill one another. Oh great, thanks Note. Hi Chair. I hear flies. Probably means another fucking dead body is near. I don't like that. No sir, I don't like that at all, girl. Oh god, what the fuck? What is that? Oh god, ah! Alright, bros. I'm gonna have to end that one there. Thanks for leaving a like. I really appreciate that. I appreciate all your support, as always. That's bros for you. See you tomorrow, bros. Love you. Bye!